Preparations for the FIFA 2018 World Cup in Russia will plough on despite widespread corruption allegations that have rocked international football's governing body in recent weeks. Despite US and Swiss-led investigations into the bidding process to host the tournament, Russian sports minister Vitaly Mutko said Wednesday that he was confident that there was no threat that the rights to hold the event could be taken away. The comments were made after inspecting stadium construction work in the Samara region of Russia, located in the southwest of the country. In principle, we acted within regulations that existed at that time. I can assure you that if something was there, then it would have come out in two or three years since. The only thing I'm worried about is wrongful accusations here. Meanwhile, at the same news conference, FIFA Secretary-General Jérôme Valk dismissed any allegations of wrongdoing over $10 million worth of bank transactions, saying, I don't have to justify myself. FIFA also announced it had delayed the start of a bidding process to host the 2026 World Cup, which had been due to be made in 2017. According to media reports, the FBI is preparing to investigate Valka and FIFA's president, Sepp Blatter, who announced his resignation last week as part of its probe into a $150 million corruption scandal involving FIFA officials.